So today I'm going to show you how to solve an equation on a TI-84 Plus uh, calculator. This method also works on other models, but uh, some of the new models have an easier way to do it. Um, but this, this does definitely work on these. So the first thing we need to do is we have an equation, uh, 3x, or 3, excuse me, times x plus 17 is equal to negative 12. The first thing we have to do in order to solve equations on this model is make uh, one expression set equal to the zero. So what I mean by that is we need to clear out one side of this equation. So this one's quite easy. We just add 12 to both sides. So now we have 3 times x plus 17 plus 12 is equal to zero. Okay. Once we have it set up like that, the calculator is able to um, correctly solve for this. So first thing we're going to do is turn on the calculator. And we're going to go into the catalog by hitting second. So the uh, arrow is up there. And then hitting the zero key. And you can see above the zero key it says catalog in blue. And then once you're there, it obviously says catalog at the top. Uh, we're looking for the solve function. Uh, but in order to get there, the fastest way to get there is to hit the four key. Because that's the, the T. If you see the green T, it'll take us to the T's. Then we scroll up to solve. It looks just like that. Solve, open parentheses. And we're going to hit enter. Once we've done that, we're going to enter this side of our equation, the expression that we created, in, uh, into the solver uh, command. So three times, we open the parentheses. Um, this time, we're going to have to, in order to use the uh, variable, we're going to hit this XT um, ON button. Those aren't actually ON. That doesn't matter, though. But hit X. We're going to add 17. Close the parentheses and then add 12. And now that our expression's in, we have to tell it what we're actually using for the uh, variable. So we hit the comma key, which is just above the 7. Okay, comma. We hit the variable key again, just to make sure it understands that, hey, we're using this x as the variable. That's what we're solving for. We hit the comma again, and these calculators like us to take a guess. It does not matter what number you put in after this comma. You could put 1, you could put 1,000. Um, but I'm just taking a guess. And then we close the parentheses hit enter and it tells us it's negative 21. So we can actually check this out to see um, by plugging it back in. I'll do this by hand just to prove to you. But 3 times negative 21 plus 17 is equal to negative 12. Okay, so 3 times negative 17 plus, sorry, negative 21 plus 17 is negative 4. It's equal to negative 12. And guess what? 3 times negative 4 equals negative 12, which is equal to negative 12. So the calculator um, got us the correct answer. Um, you can tell it's not that much less work than doing by hand, but I know some of you really enjoy using a calculator. So again, how to solve an equation on a TI-84 plus model calculator.